So here's the story of how I went from this to this. I was watching this cube repeatedly get wrecked by this car when I realized uh, I couldn't look at this boring ass scene any longer and if I wanted to keep my sanity I should at least make something prettier to look at. Thus began my great tangent of August of the year of the devil and my journey into creating a city builder because there aren't enough of those. But mine will be different I swear. Uh how? Well I mean it'll pretty much be the exact same thing as every other city builder except all the AI will be machine taught. Is that even a thing? Can you say machine taught? I'll train my AI with the power of machine learning. But alas, that is not the point of this story. This is a tale of moving cameras for a start. Pretty simple task one would think. You probably just add a script to the camera, watch a Bracky's video, copy all the code, realize the code doesn't do exactly what you want it to do, rewrite that code or heavily modify it, and voila, moving camera, done. Okay, so with that out of the way, I needed a way to place buildings like roads, houses, and random blindingly bright cube things in my world. I opted to go with the approach of using a plane as the ground platform. This after playing around with terrain generation, which whilst lots of fun to use, I decided was overkill for what I'm trying to achieve. So a plane, I needed to figure out how to divide it into some kind of grid system, which I could then use to place buildings and other goodies on top of. I fiddled with some numbers and came up with an equation to help me figure out where the starting position on our ground plane is for a tile. And once I had the starting position, I could figure out all the other positions on the plane as well. At this point, I was all coded out and I thought I'd use the time to hop into Blender and start modeling some buildings. Ugh, who am I kidding? I played Valorant for three days straight. Then I modeled the house. I modeled a street, I modeled a curved street, I prefabbed them all in Unity and realized I need a way to spawn building elements without repeating a bunch of code and being a failed programmer. I opted to use a mangled version of the factory pattern, which fits more into Unity's architecture than others. I'll do a more detailed video on the code and how it works soon, but after implementing it I can now spawn different building elements at will. I also added a canvas and some buttons to do the spawning. Finally, I needed to find a way to place buildings on my ground plane, which I achieved by snapping in context building elements to the closest position on my plane using the positions I determined earlier. Well, cool. Thanks for watching. As usual, all my code is linked in the GitHub repo down below. My game is trash, which is okay, because it can only improve, right? So please subscribe and drop a like, and I'll catch you guys on the next one.